Hey, what's going on everybody? It's Joan again. Thanks for tuning in again. Um, got this Crucible Unlimited uh, booster box in and uh, just wanted to rip it. I've actually not opened this set. Um, still planning on opening it, the first edition um, variant of it once we hit uh, 100 subscribers. So make sure you hit that subscribe button see what we can get out of here. Oh, so this is when I started putting the, um, this little pull tabs on them. actually basically already put into to order I don't see a, a token so I'll just put the heroes there nope I'm not gonna use that that was awful so yeah what do you guys think about um, fluke Sorry about that. Fluke uh, putting up that heart for live auction at zero reserve. It's definitely gonna, in my opinion, it's definitely gonna show what the actual state of the market is, which will be nice um, to actually see that. You know, it's been a minute. I don't know how long it's been since uh, an alpha heart has actually been put up for auction. Um, our first majestic, and it's a hollow. Metacarpus node. It's pretty cool. Two rares. Got my sleeves. Um, it'll actually be nice to see. Oh, I got the stupid small ones. Oh. Um where the state of the market is, because that's literally the, you know, uh, the top card of all collectors, with the exception to maybe a few, um, a few cards that were pre, basically pre-sets, um, sample cards, essentially. So, yeah, if the, if the market is, Super, super high still. That heart could sell for $25,000, $30,000 plus easy. Um, if it's come down a little bit, and that's kind of something that he's risking is it coming down. Um, then, you know, it'll actually display the market state. So you can see alpha boxes going up if it sells for an insane amount or you can see alpha boxes coming down. It might, it might actually impact the market. Um, I'm pretty excited to see it. It's also pretty awesome that he's doing that. So definitely, uh, definitely tune into that. I'll have more info as we uh, get closer to that time. Man, another Majestic. Huh. first set where they didn't do super rare so just looking out for our foils and our majestics
swing this thing later. Another majestic, another hollow majestic here on the slate. I'm not gonna sleeve these up because I got the trash sleeves. Mostly pull, you know, Shiana or uh, a shard. I'll run and get, literally run and get a better sleeve. Oh, that's pretty good. Lots of majestic stuff. Are. Something kick. Ah, they're majestic. That's crazy. different they kind of remind me of the Japanese packs that I opened in the WTR box that pulled that heart from they're not as bad that box was just crazy hard I do like how the hollow on these unlimited cards actually span onto the um, the border as well kind of reminds me a little bit of the cold flow. Nice little plus. Make some pop a little bit more. Another majestic. Oh. Is that now like six? A little bit more slippery though. Seems like. Come on, another riches. Will the majestic train stop? Sure hope not. Enchant. Predatory salt. And our last pack. Let's see if there's a shard in here. Nice. No shard. That's right. Pretty solid box. How many, how many majestics is that? One, two, three, four, six, seven, eight majestics. Man, that's crazy. All right, everyone. Thanks for tuning in again. Uh, if you haven't already, please hit that subscribe button uh, and leave a like if you like the content. All right, everyone. Till next time.